Okay, let's talk a little bit about what it takes to make your site go live. And when we say live, um, it's, it's a little bit of a semantic in that when you sign up for an account with us, your site is already live, it's just in a place where people can't see it. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the domain name that you've purchased either from GoDaddy or Yahoo or wherever you've purchased it, and we're going to point that name at our server, which is what makes your site uh, visible to your customers when they type in your name. The process is going to be similar regardless of what company you're with. Um, so what we're going to do first is uh, I'm going to play with uh, an extra domain name that I bought called abqfunjump.com and I'm going to click on Domain Manager. Now this might be called uh, Manage Your Domains. It might have references to name servers or DNS. So depending on what company you're with, uh, that's what you'll be looking for. In GoDaddy, it's Domain Manager. So you click on that first. And when it comes up, what you can do is click on the domain that you want to point. So in this case, we're playing with ABQ Fun Jump. And uh, you'll see you've got some big headers up here and a couple other ones down here. We're actually going to be playing with the two that are on the bottom, which would be pointing the A record. The A record is uh, either called the A record or it may be symbolized with the at symbol. So click on Total DNS Control. And here we're going to see a list of different names. MX is your mail exchange. That's where you can set up email and do some other stuff. Um, C names. Uh, you may need to come in here if you're uh, setting up some of those tracking methods that are out there for uh, say site tracker and things like that. But we're dealing with the A record right now which is that at symbol and all we have to do is click on the edit button that's over here. And we're going to highlight the IP address that's in there and paste in the new IP address that we are giving you. And there's the new IP address. It should read 184.106.5.226. And uh, just leave the TTL uh, at one hour. That's fine. And click OK. And that is all that it takes to point the A record. So uh, either way, uh, it's a pretty simple process. And uh, usually you'll see your site showing up within uh, the first three hours or so. Uh, worst case scenario, it might go to uh, 10 or 11, maybe even 12 hours. If it gets past that, please give us a call. Something might not be set up correctly. Uh, the, the websites always warn you that it can take 24 to 36 hours and our experience is that if it's not up you know, within 10 to 12 hours, something is wrong. So please give us a call at 505-435-9731 uh, if your site has not gone live. And the only other uh, thing to uh, make sure that you're aware of is just give us a call before you actually do this so that we know uh, to flip the switch on our end. Um, if we've already asked you to do this, then you don't have to give us a call. But uh, if you're about to go live, so the first time out, and uh, it's, it's a good idea to let us give your site a, a safety check, make sure everything is making sense before we, you point your server, and uh, then we're all set. Hope that helps. If you have any questions, give us a call or send us an email, and we'll see you soon.